so many questions that actually uh, go off my mind. Last... Kwa mkurugenzi huyu sukari sita mutena. Kwani alijipata pabaya alipotakiwa kuelezea kuwepo kwa madini kwenye sukari ilionaso wiki iliyopita. Wabunge walioanzisha uchunguzi wa sukari bandia wakitaka kujua ni nani alionyesha utepetevu kazini na kusababisha mamilioni ya magunia ya sukari mbovu kuingia nchini bila idhini ya KEBS. Why don't you have courage and say Kenyans sugar branded kabarasi it has copper. Sugar uh, U, U, G, T, Africa it has copper then you know you are poisonous and then we the rest are okay and then we move on of the sugars that we tested we did not find mercury we have not said we did not find the other things do you want to tell us that there is a possibility that there is sugar with mercury out there copper was detected and it was above the the limits which are set mkurugenzi huyo akishikilia kuwa kebs haikushiriki katika kutoa matokeo ya uchunguzi wa sukari iliyotajwa kuwa na madini hatari na waziri fred matiangi Apo jana waziri wa viwanda Aden Mohamed alidai kuwa Matiangi aliwadanganya wa Kenya kuwa kuna madini hayo hatari kwenye sukari. But those who are doing illegal business, those people who are hurting Kenyans, we are actually coming for you and for sure. We are not going to relent on this issue because it's only one person who was given the license and this is the owner of West Kenya. Uhuru must act. If it can't act, we will mobilize farmers in Western Kenya to force Uhuru to act. That is the only way. Because we cannot go and intimidate Matiangi because he has touched on an importer who has imported raw sugar. Kebs aidha imekubali kuwa huenda wa Kenya wakao wanatumia sukari yenye madini hatari ya copper na lead na kutangaza kuwa sukari hiyo lazima ikamatwe mara moja kabla ya kusababisha maradhi kwa wa Kenya. Hata hivyo shirika hilo bado halijabaini sukari hiyo ipo wapi. Wabunge sasa wanataka shirika la kutathmini uhalali wa bidhaa nchini kuhakikisha kwamba sukari yote gushi nchini imeweza kuondolewa katika soko zote nchini kuhakikisha kwamba wa Kenya hawezi kununua. Steven Leto Citizen Pashe kutoka majengo ya bunge.